Hello and welcome back to Crystal Butcher and friends. And tonight, my brothers and sisters, we've got a very special one of these. Brothers and sisters, I give to you Chris the Butcher's Super Cool Review. Yes, it's a beer review, but it's not any old beer review. It's from New Zealand, it's Spice Gold Medal Ale. Now I'm saying it's special because our brother, Bruce Collier, has sent two bottles of these over, all the way from New Zealand to England. Honestly, thank you. Bruce, you are a fucking diamond. Thank you very much. He also sent it with a, a little greeting card. Sansa. Delivering a slice of home right to your front door. And inside it says, have one on me. Best wishes from Bruce Collier. Dundin, New Zealand. Now, Bruce, if I said that wrong then, I do apologise. My English is not great. So, we got spies. In spite of that, we got spies from New Zealand. Apparently, Bruce says, this is what all New Zealanders drink. Uh, it's 4%. It's a 330ml bottle. And he said it has to be ice cold. Now, these came delivered at work yesterday. They've been in our big walk-in fridge that runs at minus four all night, all today, and about five minutes ago I got out of my fridge here. So, it's it's ice cold. Uh, for more information, contact Spice Brewery, part of the Lion Group, uh, Dundin, New Zealand. Right, look it up if you want. Have they got a website? Have they got a website? Cheers.org.nz uh, approximately one unit. Uh, Master Brewer since 1876. This beer is 99% sugar free. Mmm, I like sugar. Best before, yeah, we all know that. And it's a twist off cap. It's a twist off cap! Yes! So, are we delving into this? I've got my glass. It's clean and it's been in the fridge as well. So the glass is cold. Now, if it's a twist off cap, come from New Zealand, I've twisted the other way around. No. Can't really smell nothing yet, Bruce. But we'll uh, we'll see what happens, eh? Now, I have put it in a pipe pot. I know it's not a pint in there. A lot of bubbles, that's going to give me... This is going to repeat on me, isn't it? But then Stella has a lot of bubbles. It smells just... It smells nice. It smells really hoppy. Really fucking lagery. Pilsnery. Yes. Oh. That is fucking freezing cold. It's my teeth have just fucking froze. You know what I can imagine? That is beautiful. Now, I ain't got much of an head on it, but that might be the way I've poured it. Plus, a lot of people like me, I drink out of the bottle anyway. So it doesn't make any difference about the head. It's repeating like a fuck on me. I can imagine sat outside on the fucking porch and it being about fucking 36 degrees outside and that's fucking chilly for you. Supping one of these ice cold. With a f with, with fucking just sweat peeling off you, fucking beautiful. Bruce, I've never sucked that already. That is mighty fucking fine. Right. Anyway, you lot can fuck off while I slide the rest of this down me fucking gizzard. Oh. Oh. What are you fucking still doing here? Fuck off. Bruce, my brother. Them are fucking gorgeous. I'm just, I'm just sick there's only two of them. 
I can imagine that though, if it weren't cold, it tastes a bit like shit. But ah, it's cold, that is so, that's crisp, it's refreshing. Oh. I don't care what anyone says either. Beer out of a bottle or on draft is fucking far better than a can, right? But everyone, in the comments, give Bruce some love. Thank you very much, Bruce, for this. That is, if I had to rate that out of 10, I'd give that a solid 7.5 out of 10. It is, you know, I've never had it before and I'll probably never have it again. So, <laughs> I'm going to save this. Mmm. Mmm, yes. Very fruity note to it. So, we're going to leave it there. If you like it, press like, comment, share it on your social media. Oh, by the way, uh, I, I touched this on my live stream, last, uh, last live stream. Uh, my Chris's Kitchen backup channel. I'm not going to make it a backup channel anymore. I'm going to make it like a family vlogging channel. So, I need some suggestions on what I should call it, what name I should call it. Incidentally as well, it's going to involve Louise and the kids. And basically, some where I'm doing my weekly vlogs, I'm going to put that on there as well. And I'll probably do some live streams off there as well. But there won't be no swearing. And if there is, it's accidental, right? Because sometimes I swear, I don't know I've fucking done it. Yeah? So... Right now, I've changed nothing yet, so if you jump onto Chris's Kitchen, if I can remember, I'll put a link at the end where you can, boom, press it. Get subscribed to that, because there will be some fun and games on that, even if it's just me and kids fucking around with Snapchat filters, because they are fun, aren't they? <laughs> Let's face it, they're fun. But they're only fun when you've got kids on it laughing at you. Right? Oh, yeah. And subscribe! And become a member of Hashtag Team CTB, where I, Chris the Butcher, and Bruce Collier, thank you very much, brother, for the beers. We fucking love you.